everyone, my name is Michelle. If you are new, hi. Welcome to my channel. I am a flight attendant for a major US airline based in San Francisco, California. I vlog about my trips and I do my best to take you guys with me. Tomorrow we are starting a four day domestic trip. I have not worked a four day domestic in quite some time. I think the last time I worked a four day domestic trip was when I was Chicago based and that was a few months ago but I actually picked this trip up. I decided that I should work a little bit more this month and this week is Thanksgiving week and there are certain holidays under my airline's contract that we get paid extra if we work on that holiday and Thanksgiving is one of those holidays. So I did pick this up for the extra holiday pay. Um, and yeah, I'm excited about the trip. I. I think it's gonna be a good one. Um, tomorrow though, I have a very early wake up time. Um, my check-in is at 5.45 a.m. So I'm gonna get up at 3.30 in the morning. I haven't had a check-in that early in quite some time. So I'm not looking forward to that. Um, right now it is 7.20 p.m. And that sounds kind of early, but when you have to wake up at 3.30, it's not really early at all. So I am going to start getting ready for bed. I have everything packed up and prepped for tomorrow. I just need to fill up my lunchbox and put on my uniform. So I am going to talk to you in the morning, try to get some rest right now. Hi everyone, sorry for the bad lighting. It is 4.38 a.m. and it is pitch black outside. My check-in is at 5.45 a.m. so I'm just waiting for my car to defrost and then we will head over to the airport. Okay, so I'm in the employee lot. We have about 45 minutes until check-in and I thought I would just tell you a little bit about the trip before heading in. We are working two flights today. We go from San Francisco to Newark, which is a transcon. We consider it like like a premium route so there's a little bit extra service i haven't worked a premium transcon in a very long time i used to work them all the time when i was on reserve in san francisco but ever since i transferred to chicago i really haven't worked them at all so gonna do that we are on the 757 200 for that flight and then um when we are in newark we go down to sarasota and we take a 737 down there so let's head down. It is so crowded on those buses. I just see one coming, passing by. I am not used to check-ins this early and a lot of people start work at this time. So the parking lot was so crowded to get into today and the shuttles are gonna be super crowded. So I'm not looking forward to that. Anyway, let's head in. Okay, so I got down here 15 minutes early and the gate agent was there and our plane was here and he let me in, which is so nice. So I get to start opening my bag a little early. Okay, we just got to the hotel. It was such a good day. My crew is so much fun. It is all girls. We're all pretty junior. It's like a 2022 hire, 2021 hire, a 2018 hire, and 2017 hire. So much fun. But I have to rush because we are going to go get a drink somewhere tonight. It is popping out here. So we're going to go um, three of us and then um, our first officer. So I got to get changed and head down. Please Hi everyone, I'm back in my room. I'm about to head to bed. It is pretty late and I'm pretty tired. So I'm gonna just shower and get to sleep. Good night.
I had so much fun with my crew last night. I'm probably gonna meet up with one of the girls later on today. Don't know what we'll do yet. I want to get in a workout and also go to Whole Foods and get some stuff. So I'll probably do that. Um, I think Whole Foods closes early today because it's Thanksgiving. So I want to get there sooner rather than later. And yeah. Um, but I, as of now, I'm just trying to hydrate, drink up some water, and relax. I am excited for this 40-hour layover. Um, it's very nice because we do get the holiday pay even though we aren't actually flying today. Um, it is some, we have some, like, kind of interesting, complicated calculation on how we get our holiday pay. But if you are away from your base, you also get holiday pay. So since we are away from our base the entire day today, um, we do get paid extra, which is so nice. So I am happy to be spending Thanksgiving here in Sarasota. Um, definitely would much rather be with my family, but if I'm working, I am very happy to be in a sunny place near the beach. Makes me so happy. Um, but this hotel is so cute, like I said. Um, I, if you want the full room tour, check out my last video where I did one, but I'll just point out a few of the things that I really like about this hotel room. I like the fun little touches, like this cute, like, ice bucket that looks like a disco ball. I love this. This is a coloring type sketchbook that, um that is kind of like a guest book so people can leave sketches notes and all different guests can add on to it which i think is so cool and then they give you like a little variety of colored pencils there an espresso coffee machine is so cool such a cute little coffee station some big fluffy white robes Okay, like an hour later of lounging in my bed i am finally up ready to go to the gym let's get in a workout i know i am so tired but you know some movement will help me feel better Okay, I spent longer at the gym than I thought, so now I have to run to Whole Foods before it closes. It is 1.25 right now. It closes at 3, so let's go. from Whole Foods. I walked around a little bit, ate some food, talked to my husband, talked to my best friend, and now I'm just kind of relaxing for the night. Ooh, sorry, the hiccups. Just relaxing for the night. Obviously didn't do too much today. It was just a really relaxing, chill day. Um, and now I'm just watching Harry Potter. It's a Harry Potter marathon right now. And we have trading for trip trading um, that opens up in about an hour. So I really need to be on my phone for that because that is when we trade up our schedules for next month. So I have a lot of trading that I want to get done. And that's pretty much it for the day. Just relaxing and just enjoying this light time to myself. Okay, so it is a while later. I am done with two hours of trading for our schedule for December. I definitely did not get things that I wanted really. Um, I was able to switch a lot of things around, but I will continue to trade it throughout the month just to look for things that are better. I am constantly doing that. I'm the kind of fly attendant, a flight attendant that is constantly on the trade board trying to find better trips. Um, so that's what I'll continue to do because during this open time, trading frenzy it was really rough to get anything that i wanted um but it is 9 p.m right now which is 6 p.m california time um and i'm pretty tired honestly i think i will head to bed right now i'm just gonna shower and probably i started a new book on my commute so i'll probably do some reading then i know i didn't get out that much today didn't do anything crazy today um 
but I honestly really enjoyed taking it chill and relaxing. Um, tomorrow I do have some time. Our pickup isn't until 12.30, so I won't start getting ready until 11.30. So if I wake up early enough, I would love to go on a little walk or something. Um, but as of now, I am going to head to bed. Good night. Good morning, everybody. It is day three of four. I slept in today. I was pretty tired, which I'm surprised because I like didn't do that much yesterday, but I slept in until around nine. We have about two hours right now until we have to start getting ready for the day of work. So let's go out on a walk. It is a beautiful day outside and let's get some fresh air and some movement in. Yeah. Okay, I have been walking for a while already and I decided that we are going to walk to Publix. Not because I need more food, because I bought so much from Whole Foods yesterday, but truly because going to the grocery store is my hobby and I can't go to Publix. There's no Publix where I live or near me. So we're gonna go and take a gander. Probably should not buy anything though. Okay, I just got back from my walk. I walked a little over four and a half miles. It was really nice, but honestly, it was kind of breezy, so it got a little bit chilly, but it was a really nice day. Okay, I am all ready for pickup. I'm gonna head down in about five minutes. Today is gonna be a long day of flying. We got two flights. First one will be pretty short. It's um, Sarasota to Washington Dulles, and um, I am first class galley. I don't even know if I told you. That's my position for this trip, first class galley. So we have a full lunch service up in the front, and then we go from DC all the way to Seattle, which will be a long flight. That will be probably uh, six hours or so and we will definitely have a full dinner service for that, but then we have a short layover in Seattle. Um, I think we're on both 737-800s today, and yeah, I'm excited to get this day going, uh, but yeah, not really looking forward to that long flight. I will talk to you all later. Hi everyone, we have made it to Seattle. Today was a really good day. I was kind of dreading today just because we had the flight for Syracuse Dulles, which I knew would be fine, but I was kind of dreading the Dulles to Seattle flight because it was supposed to be pretty long, but we got very lucky with our winds. There weren't many headwinds, so we actually got here a half an hour early. I thought the flight time was gonna be like six hours. It was only five hours and four minutes. So I was super grateful for that. And then also um, my passengers were just super chill up in first class. Everyone was super nice. Some of them just slept the whole entire flight. So it was good. I am tired though. It is 9.21. So um, we have a short layover here. Our pickup is at 9.30 a.m. So I will get ready around 8.30. No plans really today um, for this layover because it's so short and it's already so late. Um, but I'll give you a little hotel room tour. I have stayed here once before. I think I did actually vlog that trip. Um, and I got this trip off reserve. I remember when I was based in SFO on reserve and I have stayed here once, but it hasn't been for a while. So I'll do a little room tour and then, um, yeah, we'll head to bed after that. Okay, first thing to point out, you guys know I love the wood floors instead of carpet. I love it so much. Just got a simple closet over here. And nothing to note. And then the bathroom is cute. <laughs> nice good counter space, nice lighting, and a nice shower. And then a place to put my suitcase up here. Um, I think the lighting is cool. I just love all like the wood details, it's just really nice. 
very sleek but a very simple room and then this hotel is kind of shaped so everything like looks at each other i don't know how to describe it it's like a a circle so this is the inside of the hotel there you can see like there's other rooms there and then the gym is right there and i think the lobby and restaurant are right there so um it, honestly it feels kind of like a campy woodsy feel Okay, I'm gonna head to bed. I will talk to you all in the morning. Okay, everyone, it is day four of four. It is go home day, kind of. It is day four of seven for me because I'm working seven days straight, but it's go home day for this trip. Um, we are kind of doing a Chicago turn today. We go from Seattle to Chicago. We sit for three and a half hours, which kind of sucks, but then we go back from Chicago to San Francisco. We end our trip around 10 30 p.m. And yeah, uh, we are working on an Airbus going to Chicago and then an Air, a uh, triple seven going back to San Francisco. So on the Airbus, minimum crew is three, um, which means I will be working in the back um, for beverage economy aisle. And that is the first time I will be in the back this whole trip. Um, I've been first class galley this whole uh, trip so far. And then when we come back, we will be on the triple seven, which means I'll be back in first class galley, back on the big wide body. And yeah, let's have a good day. Talk to you guys later. Got lost and we walked to the wrong way. I went to the wrong floor. Now we're running to the lobby. I haven't been on an Airbus in so long that um, I got like this notification that I had to review the door operations, which I did, don't worry. Um, but it's just so funny because I've been flying white bodies and 737s for the past couple months. Our captain bought us coffee, so sweet. And then I had some nut pot creamer that I brought with me to add in it. it is the next day the day after my four-day trip ended um i'm actually in the employee parking lot right now ready to start another trip today um but i wanted to close off the vlog yesterday went really well it was um a long day we did seattle to chicago we sat in chicago chicago to san francisco we were a little bit delayed going to san francisco a plane's gonna go over me it might be a little loud But honestly, um, it was not bad at all. Um, the crew was really fun. We were overstaffed. We had 11 people um, when minimum crew was eight. So the workload was really easy. And yeah, then I got home really late, didn't vlog, just went straight home to sleep so I could rest up for this trip today. I am so, 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 so happy that I had that four day. My crew was amazing. We had so much fun. I had not laughed that hard on a trip maybe ever. Um, and I just like it was definitely one of like my favorite trips because not because like the trip was super cool or super exciting but I just felt like we all as a crew got along so well and we just had such a good time together so I'm very very happy about that um and I am just I couldn't have asked for a better Thanksgiving trip Okay, so I'm going to close out this vlog here. Thank you so much for watching. Really, really appreciate your love and support. Give the video a thumbs up if you would like and give me a follow on Instagram too. I don't vlog every single one of my trips, but I usually do post about the trip on Instagram and it's just a little bit more real time kind of content. If you are interested in that, uh, my Instagram is dear underscore Michelle. I'll have it written down here and then also linked down below. Thank you again for watching. I will talk to you in my next video.